They called it a blighted ovum and they said it was bad luck. But here is what they didn't test for. A blighted ovum is a type of miscarriage where the fertilized egg implants but then the embryo never develops and that's heartbreaking because you get a positive test your hcg rises and also obviously your hope is rising and then it's actually ending up in nothing and that's devastating and doctors will usually tell you it just happens try just again and no not every case is preventable but because a blighted ovum is often linked to chromosomal abnormalities but why do those happen well, number one, you have the quality of your eggs, and that's influenced by things like oxidative stress, nutrient depletion, and insulin resistance. The other thing is that you might have methylation issues. If your B9 and B12 pathways aren't supported, then the DNA replication that should happen suffers. Then on top comes that if your thyroid health suffers, even if you just have a TSH of 2.5 and above that can increase your miscarriage risk and also if you have low progesterone that can delay proper implantation and well just doesn't lead to a pregnancy and confuse the whole process one woman i worked with had two blighted ovums in a row and her doctor said you know it's unlucky but her homocysteine levels were too high and that told me that probably her methylation was off so we supported her with activated b vitamins liver support and also blood sugar balance and a voila six months later she had a normal pregnancy and a heartbeat at eight weeks isn't that wonderful you deserve more than just try again inside my fertility circle I give you answers, not platitudes. Link is in my bio. Join me now.